Terry Garr's career in the entertainment industry was characterized by her exceptional talent and versatility as an actress. Over the decades, she established herself as a beloved figure in film and television, known for her impeccable comedic timing and ability to seamlessly transition between comedy and drama. However, alongside her many career achievements, Terry faced significant health challenges that ultimately led her to retire from the spotlight. Join Facts First as we present Terry Garr is retired from acting after her tragic diagnosis. Terry's Diagnosis Terry Garr, the beloved American actress known for her versatile roles, faced a significant health challenge when she was diagnosed with multiple sclerosis, or MS, in the late 1990s. MS is a chronic autoimmune disease that affects the central nervous system, causing a range of physical and neurological symptoms. Terry's diagnosis had a profound impact on her life, leading to both personal and public awareness about living with this condition. She first noticed symptoms of MS in the early 1980s, but it was initially misdiagnosed. It wasn't until several years later, in 1999, that she received the correct diagnosis of multiple sclerosis. It can manifest in various ways, with symptoms that may include fatigue, muscle weakness, difficulty with coordination, vision problems, and cognitive impairment. Terry's journey with MS has involved managing these and other symptoms. Living with MS has significantly affected her life and career. She's been open about challenges she faces, including the physical limitations that MS can impose. For an actress known for her physical comedy and expressive performances, these changes were particularly challenging. She had to adapt her life and career to accommodate her health needs, which included managing her energy level and dealing with mobility issues. Despite these difficulties, Terry continued to work in the industry and maintain a public presence, though less frequently than before her diagnosis. Her candor about her experiences with MS served as an inspiration for others facing the disease, providing a valuable example of how one can persevere and adapt to life's challenges. Her advocacy efforts have also helped raise awareness about MS and the importance of supporting research for treatments and a cure. Her story underscores the importance of resilience and determination when living with a chronic condition like MS. Brain Aneurysm Terry experienced a life-changing event in 2006 when she suffered a brain aneurysm. This medical condition had a profound impact on her life and career, shedding light on the importance of awareness and early detection of such critical health issues. A brain aneurysm is a potentially life-threatening condition characterized by a weak or bulging spot in the wall of a blood vessel within the brain. If left untreated, an aneurysm can rupture leading to bleeding in the space surrounding the brain or other severe complications. Terry's case was a reminder that brain aneurysms can affect anyone, regardless of their age or health. In December 2006, she experienced symptoms of a severe headache, which she initially dismissed as a migraine. But when the pain persisted and intensified, she sought medical attention. Doctors diagnosed her with a brain aneurysm and quickly took action to address the issue. She underwent surgery to repair it, a procedure aimed at preventing a rupture and its potentially devastating consequences. Following the surgery, Terry faced a challenging road to recovery. She experienced physical and cognitive challenges, including difficulties with balance and speech. These are common side effects of brain surgery, especially when it involves the delicate structures of the brain. Her determination and resilience, coupled with ongoing rehabilitation and therapy, played a significant role in her recovery. Terry's openness about her experience with a brain aneurysm raised awareness about this often silent and life-threatening condition. Her willingness to share her story and advocate for brain health encouraged others to seek medical attention. Advocacy and Charity Work Terry has been involved in various charitable and philanthropic endeavors throughout her life, using her platform and personal experiences to support causes she cares about. While her public appearances have become less frequent due to her health challenges, she's remained committed to making a positive impact in her community and beyond. Here are some of the philanthropic activities Terry's been involved in. National Multiple Sclerosis Society Given her own diagnosis of MS, Terry has been an active advocate for MS awareness and research. She's participated in events and campaigns organized by the National MS Society helping to raise funds and increase public understanding of the disease. 
the Hollyrod Foundation. Terry has lent her support to the Hollyrod Foundation, an organization founded by actress Holly Robinson Pete and her husband, former NFL player Rodney Pete. The foundation is dedicated to providing support and resources to people and families affected by autism and Parkinson's disease. Terry's involvement reflects her commitment to helping those facing neurological conditions like MS. Charity Events Over the years, Terry has participated in charity events and fundraisers to support various causes, including those related to healthcare, education, and the arts. Her presence has helped raise awareness and funds for these important charitable organizations. Advocacy for Women's Health Terry has also used her platform to advocate for women's health issues. She's spoken about the importance of regular health checkups and early detection of health conditions, particularly among women. Through interviews and public speaking engagements, Terry Garr has shared her personal experiences with her own health challenges, including MS and her recovery from her brain aneurysm. By doing so, she's helped educate the public about these conditions and encouraged others to seek medical attention and support when needed. Career Highlights Terry Garr enjoyed a successful and versatile career in the entertainment industry with a wide range of film and television roles that showcased her talent and versatility as an actress. Here are just some of the highlights. Her career began in the 1960s when she worked as a dancer in various television shows and films. She gained recognition for her dance skills and quickly transitioned into acting. One of her early career breakthroughs came when she appeared in the iconic 1974 comedy Young Frankenstein, directed by Mel Brooks. Her role as Inga, the lab assistant, showcased her comedic timing and physical comedy skills. She received acclaim for her role as Sandy Lester in the 1977 film Close Encounters of the Third Kind, directed by Steven Spielberg. The film was a massive success, and her performance added to its appeal. In 1982, she starred alongside Dustin Hoffman in the comedy-drama film Tootsie, and her performance earned her an Academy Award nomination for Best Supporting Actress. Her talent wasn't limited to film. She also had a successful television career. She received an Emmy Award nomination for her role in the 1988 TV movie The Last Electric Night. Throughout the 80s and 90s, Terry appeared in numerous TV shows and films, showcasing her versatility. She was known for an ability to tackle both dramatic and comedic roles with equal skill. She also made memorable guest appearances in popular shows like Friends and Seinfeld, where her comedic talents shined. Her contribution to the entertainment industry extended to voice acting, too. She lent her voice to animated series like Batman, the Animated Series, and Johnny Bravo. While her health challenges, including her battle with MS, slowed her down in later years, her legacy as a talented and influential actress remains intact. Now it's time to hear from you. What's your favorite role from Terry Garr? Did you know she was battling such severe health issues? Let us know in the comments section below.